Minister for Culture, Josepha Madigan, announced an initiative yesterday called Ireland Performs, which is supposed to help artists through the COVID-19 crisis. And I'm just making this video because I've spoken to a number of artists who are frankly disgusted by the whole thing. Because what it involves is basically a partnership between uh, Culture Ireland and Facebook, uh, where a fund of €100,000 is being put forward uh, that will be available to 100 artists. So €1,000 per artist in return for performances that will be done on Facebook. Now, Obviously, Facebook will own the rights to this music, uh, they'll own the copyright. This is a company that's under uh, multiple inv investigations for data breaches, uh, a multinational tax dodging company, and artists will basically be made to compete for funding. Um, one of the three criteria, incidentally, um, is in getting this funding is social media following. So um, how many likes you have on Facebook will dictate uh, in part at least how much funding or whether you get funding from Facebook. Um, I think we have to ask why the state is working with and providing PR for a massive tax dodging company uh, when what we get in return for it is that a uh, hundred artists will be able to pay for rent and possibly food for one month uh, if they're in Dublin, maybe two months uh, in places where rent is a little bit lower. Um, this isn't to say that artists are doing any worse than anybody else uh, at this point, and I think you know everybody's struggling and everybody needs to be looked after. And indeed, I would say that those at the front lines of this crisis, the healthcare workers, the care workers, um, transport workers, people stacking the shelves in supermarkets, these are the people that are carrying us through this crisis, and they should be paid, you know, reward pay and hazard pay for what they're doing. Um, but people have also said uh, how much artists are actually helping them through uh, get through this the, uh, this crisis and how art and music have been hugely important to people in getting through the long days of isolation. Um, Josepha Maligan spoke uh, on Friday about how the arts can heal the nation. And to be honest, I can't divorce that statement from her record because uh, this is somebody who uh, was accused of insulting traveller culture with some good reason because she passed on... Um, queries about funding for traveller arts, she passed it on to the Minister for Justice. Uh, this is somebody who campaigned against uh, traveller housing So, uh, as well. So as an anti-racist campaigner, I find this reprehensible, um, but also as a musician and uh, somebody who has a huge respect for the rich culture of traveller music and song, it's particularly galling, and uh, I don't think somebody like this should be a Minister for, for, for Culture. Um, Fine Gael's record in general on the arts is one of severe underfunding and much of the funding that does exist is tied up with these kinds of corporate partnerships. So when Madigan talks about healing the nation, it doesn't really ring true to me because uh, the message from uh, Fine Gael is clearly that unless you're one of the few artists that, that make it, you only really deserve to merely exist. You deserve to just about survive and even what you do uh, has to be profitable uh, to some kind of multinational or other. There has to be money made out of it uh, for uh, for a corporation, and it has to be marketable. And I think we're in uh, the de the depths of a major crisis at the moment. But I I I would like it if we were to start thinking about what kind of society we want to we want to build out. Uh, you know, after this crisis. Um, and I would say that we should be trying to build a society where artists can be given the time and the space to create their art, that it shouldn't be dependent on the profits of multinational co corporations, and that we should have a society where every single person uh, who, 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 who in, you know, on this island should be able to explore art, create art, um, and enjoy art and music, you know, um, and that it should be for, for everybody.